My name is Jerry. I have been building hammer dulcimers in this valley since 1975. I built my first one in my dormitory at Warren Wilson College, which is about three miles in that direction behind the camera. Moved into a little house by Bee Tree Lake um, in 75. I rented it for $60 a month for five years and built hammer dulcimers in the basement of that house. Had a great time. It was a beautiful place. Uh, stream in front, stream in back, cherry trees, apple trees. Had the opportunity to buy that house, three acres, for $20,000, but I could not imagine how to come up with $20,000 or how to borrow that much money. So I moved out, moved in, into Black Mountain and rented my workshop space, which over the next five years, turned into more of a showroom than a workshop, so I had to build a workshop. So I built it here. I bought this house here in uh, East Asheville in 1989. In 1994, I built a workshop here. And so then Black Mountain became just a showroom. So I've been building instruments here for the last 25 years. I love it, it's fantastic. I made my first recording in 1981 called The Strayway Child. I produced it myself. Made my own record label, uh, had a, I just had a ball learning how to do all that stuff and being in the recording studio and, you know, arranging music and trying to figure out what would, you know, touch somebody's heart somehow musically. No words, just instrumental. Everything I've ever done has been instrumental. Um, in 1986, I made my second recording, Heart Dance, and in 1992, I finished the trilogy with the last CD uh, called Homecoming. And a few years later, I had an opportunity to make a Christmas album, which I always wanted, really wanted to make a Christmas album. And out of the blue, or so it seemed, uh, the agent of Ruth Bell Graham called and said, the Grahams would like me to make a recording based on Ruth's book, One Wintry Night. We had played a few times at Billy Graham Training Center, The Cove here in Asheville, and I guess they liked the sound of what we were doing or something. So we, in 1998, made the recording One Wintry Night. Um, that pretty much finishes my recording career. I haven't done anything since, although I would like to, but I haven't. Um, so I start every day here at my house. I wake up around dawn, usually, and I head up the mountain. I spend the first hour and a half communing with my father in the forest. It's an oxygen factory. It's a great way to start the day. Uh, usually about four and a half miles is, is about what I hike each day. I go up about 550 vertical feet. It's a beautiful thing. I see bears out there and deer and all kinds of fun things. Great way to start the day. Um, I would like to invite you to visit if you ever get the chance. If you're ever in Western North Carolina, we could share a story, maybe a song or just spend some time to commune. My greatest gift, the greatest blessing to me, is to meet my brothers and sisters from all over the world. I would love to meet you if you feel so inclined. Give me a call, email me, don't be a stranger.